Hello, hello. Yo, all right, so, uh, why do I say yo? Hello, lovely people out there in the city of rawness. Yo, raw food city, Bobby Buns. Today is day two. Yes, day two, officially. That's right, right? I got my days confused because I do work nights. And hopefully, that'll end soon. But, for right now, that's what we're doing. And today is day two, and I never felt so good ever. <laughs> oh, I'm giddy. I'm giddy. When you start juicing, you cannot sit still. It's crazy. I'm sitting here. I have a desk job. And I... I bought this with me. I tie this around one of the doors and I just start going crazy with it. I start doing lunges, I start doing push-ups. I can't even stop myself, the energy I have. It's just amazing when you, uh, because for the past two days, I was, you know, it was New Year's Eve, right? So, had a little sip of wine, had a little baked potato, and Man, had a little rice. It didn't go overboard, but it just shows you how that shit slows you down. It does. Student just walked by. I'm just talking to myself. Uh, yeah, so it just slows you down to a to a crawl. I notice when I am feeling vibrant and energetic and on top of the world, I am not eating. <laughs> yeah, I said it, it's, it's all juice. But when I do bring in the foods, I try to make it, see, you know what it is? It might be the salt. I do have like an addiction to salt and I feel salt, salt and everything. So I think when I take a break from salt, I, uh, I feel a lot better. Does that make sense? Uh, so the deeper I go into this raw diet, and I don't wanna overwhelm anybody, but you really get to figure out your body. You really, really start understanding yourself and and the foods you eat, because back when you were on the SAD diet, you know, standard American diet, you're eating all day long and, and everything and anything you get your hands on, you know? Like, I, I was I was eating maybe five, six meals a day at no particular time. You know, I, I would wake up and have dinner for breakfast, and you're still digesting what you ate the meal before. You're like, we're really only supposed to eat once a day. You know, that whole thing about breakfast is the is, is an important meal is all bullshit. Yeah, I hate to say it, but I don't want to scare anybody, but look, if cooked food is a drug, man, no matter how you look at it, if you want to feel super vibrant, super energetic, and live the rest of your life to its highest potential, you can't cook your food. All right? So, there it is. Simple, right? <laughs> it really is. And the amount of recipes. I'm gonna start doing recipes. I have to, I have to, I have to. Because people don't know. People don't know. So, it's really just about putting the right gas in this car, man. This is your body, this is your temple. When you're eating that slice of pizza, do you really think that that's okay? It's not, it's not. In the last 10 years, I questioned every time I ate a slice of pizza, and it's hard to stay away from pizza here in Staten Island, is why I think I'm gonna start like a little business at home, only because I've made the most amazing raw food pizza you could ever imagine with soft, bready crust, 
and amazing sauce, thick sauce, and beautiful cashew pine nut cheese. It tastes just like cheese and imitation, my little pepperonis. Let's you know, do this shit together, yo. Let's have fun. Let's have fun. Today's day, day two. I just wanted to explain to you how amazing I felt on my raw juice, on my juice fast. Um, I'm going to, I'm going to go, th definitely I'm going to go 30 days, but what I really want to do is go 90. So I'm going to take it to 30. I've done 21 before. I'm going to take it to 30. I'm going to go far. I'm going to go far at this one. 80 days, 90 days is what I really want to do. And... It's funny because you use, you you lose a pound a day on a on a juice fast, guaranteed. Sometimes two, depending on you, but guaranteed a pound. I just keep hitting. Stop, boys! I just love it. I love it. Oh, sucker. juice, juice, juice! It's all about the juice. Yeah. So what I made today was um, organic pear, celery, apple. Parsley, kale, ginger. Put that in a blend. Not in a blender. I put that in a juicer. Oh, it was so good. I can't even explain Listen it. To me. I love you. I want you to feel what I feel. You can do this. If I could do this, you can do this. I was a beer drinking, pizza, steak eating freak for years. And I didn't know. I didn't want to know. So if you're watching this channel, you want to know. So I'm letting you know. Okay? It's okay. Start doing good for yourself. Feed that machine. You deserve it. You do. Peace and love, man. Raw Food City. Bobby Buns out there. Bobby Buns loves you. Baba Buns. Baba Bunza. Baba Bunza. Alright? You'll be alright. I'm making a video every day on this juice fast, 100%. Tell you how I feel. First day is always really good. Second day is always really good. Third day is usually weird for me. So I'll let you know about the third day. Maybe I don't even feel that bad on the third day. But the third day, I have to have juice ready for me at all times because every time I feel weird, I gotta pound down juice. Because usually I detox from coffee. I have a little love affair with coffee and, 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 and potatoes. So I, I just got to figure out. That, that's It's almost out of my life. It's almost out of my life. But uh, you know what I'm saying? Because if you feel so good when you're doing this, then why would you want to go back to that? You know, it's really just in the brain. So anyway, World Food City, over and out. Love you guys. Day two, baby. 2017. What? January 2nd. Make love.